City leaders spent a lot of time talking about how to develop business and grow the city's economy. There is one part of the city that is already celebrating a long run of business success. News 13's Francesca Washington takes a closer look at the Bricklight District. Tucked away along Central. So it's just cool seeing the energy and like the vibes. Right across from UNM. People that when they feel welcomed. If they feel that they can be a part of that community. Is Albuquerque's Bricklight District. I mean, I like definitely this street. It's, it's, a, it's a great street. You know, I think I wish there was more streets like this. Uh, near the university or in Albuquerque in general. Developers Jay Ramby and Alan Lewis bought the property back in 2002. At the time it was, you know, it was known as Harvard Mall and, you know, as our interest was to really figure out an overall master plan that encouraged walkability. Over the past 17 years, apartments have been developed and local restaurants and retail shops have moved in. I think the fact that it's well lit, there's a lot of restaurants, uh, there's some pubs, it's near the university, so I think it's, you know, I think that's a good combination. Developers say they wanted to create a unique environment that keeps people coming back. You know, people are looking for, you know, an experience where uh, they're just not going to a, a suburban um, mall where they're, you know, stopping in a large parking lot having to walk through a sea of parking lot. That's not what we wanted to create here. They say now that the ART is up and running, people should be on the lookout for more additions to the district. We've built the synergy. Now it's we're ready to take it to another level, and I think it'll be very exciting some of the announcements we'll have in the next couple months. Those who visit the area say they are excited for more to do in the metro. Well, I think this is what Albuquerque needs. Francesca Washington, KRQE News 13. Developers say since 2002, they've added about 60,000 square feet of new buildings in the district light, the brick light district rather.